Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do your daily vibes for the six. But you know, the timing is fluid. This is for somebody I don't know who may or may not be for you. It's not sign specific. Daily energy, daily reading for the six may or may not be for you. Let's get one of these, and then we will use that deck right there. I don't know why I'm flipping, but I am, so there's a reason for that. So, let's just see what comes up. Hmm. Well, blossoming abundance. Now, number three, you know, that's the Empress card, and she is blossoming abundance. So, yeah, we have, this is like a rebirth. That is what blossoming abundance is, I mean. There's beauty. There's 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 beauty everywhere. And there really is. It's crystal clear too. Something is crystal clear. There's growth. Things are coming to fruition. All right, what do we got? There's a lot of uh, freedom here, personal freedom, right? There is. Judgment reversed. <laughs> well, there could be some sort of secret, okay? Somebody may not be telling the truth on, on you know, unfortunately. <laughs> Somebody may be asleep, you know, they're not awakened. You know, they may not be aware. They may not be aware of the abundance that is around them. Five of Pentacles reversed. This is the coming out of darkness, accepting help or acceptance of something. Ooh, temperance reversed. Yikes. So there's there's some sort of imbalance here. Something's not coming together as it should. Somebody could be resisting change, obviously. <laughs> King of Rods. That's King of Wands. Looks like he's got a mission. He's headed somewhere. He's headed out of this dark situation. He is. He's headed out of this stage, whatever it is. He's headed out. He's headed in. Well, we're going to see what he's headed into in a minute, but. Hmm. Ooh. Well, the star reversed. There's still hope. There's, 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 there's wish. This is a. There's hope. This is peace. This is renewal. He's headed towards this dream. I'm going, even though it hasn't happened yet, he's headed towards it. It's like I see this bright light. I see this bright thing. He's headed towards a brighter future, honestly. He really is. Looks like his mind is made up, too. He's on his way. It's like there's no stopping this guy. We got this guy that is headed towards something. It's like, I'm going to get it. I got to go get this. But 
He's leaving the bullshit behind by the looks of things. The insecurities, for sure. Hmm. There may have been some self-doubt with this card. This is a card of self-doubt. It's been, it's been extreme, up, extreme, extremes, okay? Extreme up and downs, back and forth. Maybe some sort of confused, confusion. But now we have somebody here that is excited about this new beginning. This is excitement, ready to take a leap of faith. Leave it all behind. Leave the past behind. And this guy is like ready to fly, like it's freedom. Yeah. Yeah, we got somebody here that is ready to fly. Very excited. Excited for this new adventure, this new chapter. Starting at zero, starting fresh with a clean slate. The Wheel of Fortune. This is Wheel of Fortune reverse. Somebody has like been clinging to control. They may have been through a run of bad luck that has kept them stuck. Somebody's life has really been turned upside down. There's no doubt about that. Things have been crazy, crazy, crazy unbalanced. And maybe it's because this person is very free-spirited and, you know, is may not be fully aware of the dangers. Somebody may not be fully aware of the dangers ahead of them. It's an exciting opportunity, but there could be some dangers that you don't see. So somebody may not be aware that they're about to leap into something dangerous. <laughs> Nine of Cups, wish fulfillment. This is a, an opportunity to have it all. We got somebody here that is happy, joyful, you know, <laughs> celebrating life. It's like this is a... Happy times. I mean, this is happiness. This is extreme happiness. We got somebody here that is, you know, just really having a good old time here. Having a good old time. And this is an opportunity to, you know, have it all. The family, the friends, the, you know, celebrate life, you know. Ace of Swords. But somebody's probably not telling the truth. Somebody's being dishonest. Somebody is, you know, probably, again, not aware. We have this lack of awareness here. Somebody is not aware of the dangers of, you know, leaping before you look. you got to look before you leap unless you, you, you're looking for some sort of trouble. I mean, the Wheel of Fortune is bad luck, bad fortune, okay? Make sure you're wide awake, okay? So there's, this is like, this is, may, somebody may be seeing things with rose-colored glasses. You know, and they, things are, may not be as they seem. They may not be as they seem. Um, that temperance reverse, there's, this is like ups and downs, highs and lows. You know, this is extremes, like one, this is like bipolar in reverse, seriously. You know, mm. this person looks like he's got, he's a little angry. He does. We got somebody who's turning his back on something. Maybe he's, this is angry. We got somebody who's angry or upset for sure. Upset over a situation. He may be turning his back on somebody that has caused a lot of imbalance in their life or has caused upheaval of some sort, caused chaos. Looks like we have somebody here that may be turning their back on somebody. I don't know. Page of Pentacles. Now, this page uh, is ready to try new things. It's ready to start a new uh, endeavor, right? Um, a new enterprise. So this is a new beginning here. 
starting something. Um, and it could grow. It could grow into something big. This looks like this guy's caught something. This guy has caught something valuable. He has. He's hooked on to something valuable. Yep. That's what's going on here. You know, so it looks like he's about ready to reel it in. <laughs> yeah, looks like he is about ready to reel it in. Um, looks like we, we, we have somebody that may not be aware because there's this overwhelming excitement. There could be this overwhelming joy, you know, that this is an opportunity to have it all with somebody that may be a little, maybe imbalanced. I don't know. This person may have temper tantrums, temperance reversed. That just came to me. I don't know where that came from. Weird. I don't think I've ever said that. Temper tantrums. We could deal, we deal with somebody who has a, has a temper. This guy does look upset, so just be careful. Be careful. This person may play victim. This is victim. They may play the victim. Just be careful. Just be careful. All that is glitter is is not gold. Okay? That's funny. I, I was looking over here, and then I looked up here. Anyway, we have somebody here that... This guy is taking action to go after this star, this this uh, beautiful, shining, whatever it is. This is a star. Opportunity, wish. This is what he's. This is like. This is what I've always wanted. He's about, you know, he's, that looks like somebody is going to get something that is very bright. You know, this is, is bright. Um, let's get some more cards. Five of rods, five of wands reversed. This is actually better in reversed. This is patience is needed. Maybe there's some sort of competition and he needs to go grab it before the competition does because see the competition, he wants to ward off the competition. There is, that's competition here. The Three of Pentacles doesn't want somebody to work together with, with anybody else. So this three of pentacles is about working together. It's reversed. They don't we got somebody here that is taking action because I think their life has been turned upside down. They may be angry and upset because somebody is moving, you know, maybe they're they're partying and having fun and, and having it all with somebody else. And they don't want this person to move forward. Uh oh, this ain't good. Nope. We got somebody here that doesn't want the competition to win. Doesn't want another person to work with somebody else. And they can see that there's, there's, there's happiness going on. There's, there is. This is like a celebration. This is dancing, having fun. Uh, the whole nine yards right here. We got somebody here that is probably have, throwing a tantrum or who is upset and angry. And this guy is about to take action. Of some sort, because this guy takes action. Mm, eight of rods. This this is whew, no communication, blocked communication. Somebody may have blocked another person from communicating. Now we got somebody who's really pissed off and really upset right here. There's like. Communication has been blocked or communication has come to a complete standstill. This guy is not happy. Somebody's not happy. There's no more communication going on. Somebody's having fun someplace else.
And we got this person that has been thinking, um, isolating themselves. I'm trying to, to, to decide what to do next, how to handle this situation. Restraining themselves, going within, using stillness as their tool. Taking a time out. We got somebody here that is taking a time out and they are focusing on the next step. We have somebody here that is becoming aware, that is after not being aware. They are becoming aware. <laughs> they're becoming aware of the competition. They're become they're seeing this guy is seeing that whoever it is that they are watching is working with somebody else. And that they're they're happy and that they're blossoming. This is the blossoming abundance, this nine of cups. And we got somebody here that's not happy with what they are seeing. It's like this wish, this dream. I gotta get it before it's gone, because it's starting to fall away. It's starting to, you know, go downhill. It is. This guy's like, I got to go get it before it's too late, before it's gone. I got to reel this in before it's gone. So I really believe that we have somebody. I don't know if there's going to be any communication because this is no communication. This is blocked communication. Or no response to communication. Is there going to be any communication? I don't know. Here we have somebody that is starting fresh. I mean, this person has decided to not even focus on this anymore. I'm going in another direction. And this guy sees it. This person's like, oh, they're, they're gone. Gone. They're gone. Perhaps some of the competition swooped them up while they were sleeping. The lovers reverse. Well, of course, of course, somebody is probably, you know, losing a contract, right? There's consequences for not communicating, for not moving forward, for isolating yourself, for retreating. I mean, to the other person, yes, there's always a reason for it to become consciously aware. And yes, it's a needed, but... You know, you, then you sacrifice the the love contract, you know. You sacrifice the love. So, I, I, you know, I feel like we have somebody here that is thinking about their non-action. They're thinking about their loss. And they're in they've been undecided they've been undecided for quite some time but they don't want to let it go this is clinging to the past clinging to the memories maybe that's why this could be a past connection which somebody just doesn't want to let go somebody keeps looking back at the past they keep looking back at something looking back at the memories or looking back at the love this is what's going on here looking back at what was And it's like they don't want this person to go. Yeah, they want to go. They want this person back. Seven of Swords. Seven of Swords reverse. Somebody want, and this has come back. Baby, come back. That kind of thing. King of Pentacles. I got something for you. Something secure, something solid, something stable, something that will last.
So I feel as though we have somebody that is thinking, they're really thinking on this day about what they have to offer, about what they're willing to offer, about how they are going to fight off the competition. This is the competition. There is a competition here. I don't know if I got that in the camera for you guys good enough. You see it? Definitely. So, now somebody wants a fresh start. They want to do over. Can we do this over? Can we? So it looks like we have somebody. This guy is taking action. So they may, you, something could happen today because this guy, he's not sitting back. He's not waiting. Somebody is taking action to go after this dream come true before it slips away and somebody else reels it in. So that is what we got for the six. This is probably somebody that you already know. Okay. It is somebody that you already know. Okay. With the with this six of cups now right next to the lovers. I do think that you already know this person. And obviously I said baby come back. So you probably do not. You do. There may have been no communication or blocked communication or whatever it is. But you saw that card fall out, right? Passion. Allow your heart and soul to sing with joy. So somebody is about to go after what they are passionate about. Before it's too late. Um, this guy, is he's made, his mind is made up. There's no stopping him. This could be the one. You've already met the romantic partner you seek. And like I said, I think it is somebody you know. So... <sighs> Somebody's been dishonest about their feelings, and now they, they want to, you know, they want to catch it before somebody else does. So be prepared. Be prepared. I think that, I mean, <laughs> allow your heart and soul to sing with joy. Somebody is about to... reel another person right in. That's what I got. Good luck.